Good morning, San Diego. It's Mike Lewis with the Lewis team. It's Tuesday, October 22nd, 2024. We have a total of 26 new homes that hit the market and 18 new condos. That's 44 properties total this morning I'll be showing you. Overall in San Diego County, there's 2,798 single-family detached homes on the market and 1,852 single-family attached homes on the market. If we add those number, numbers together, there's 4,650 single-family properties on the market in San Diego County right now. So our mailing went out for our recipe, classic beef stew. Ooh, that's a yummy one, huh? If you're, you want to get on that mailing list, Give me a call, shoot me an email, I'll get you on there. Get one of those a month. You have a good little recipe card collection after a while. So let's get looking at those 44 new properties that hit the market. See what's out there. Okay, let's have a look here. 26 new properties on the market, south to north. 26 new homes have one down here in the South Bay. Looks like it might be Imperial Beach or Otay, or, um, Otay Mesa. Let's see. Otay Mesa. Grove Avenue, 885. Four bed, three bath, 1883 square feet. Beautifully updated. Move in ready. Let's take a look. High ceilings. Remodeled kitchen. Quartz countertops, light backsplash, stainless steel appliances. Let's see what we got for a yard. There's the front. It's like a quite a bit of a newer home. There's a lot of older homes in this part of Otay Mesa. And this is definitely um not too bad. 1998, so I'm 26 years old. Go check it out if you're looking in Otay Mesa. Okay, let's back out. <clears throat> what do we got here? Chula Vista. 919 First Avenue, five bed, four bath, 1992 square feet. Wow. Wonderful five bedroom, immaculate turnkey, original owner. Okay, this is 919, one picture. 919.9, so not much to show you or to look at there. Okay, we've got another one here in Chula Vista for $859,900 on East J Street. Three bed, two bath, 1,394 square feet. And, wow, paid solar, single story, newer roof. Let's check it out. They love to use the word wow and not have any pictures. Okay. I'd like to show you more on that one, but no photos. What do we got down here? There's one on the market for, let's see. 1,049,000 Camino Marcella, four bed, three bath, 2,143 square feet. Time to live the Escaya dream. <clears throat> wow. Welcome home to one of the best locations and floor plans in the entire village of Escaya. Okay, let's take a look. There it is, one of the best, they say. Let's check it out. Tile flooring. Covered patio outside. I like the stamped concrete. Looks really good. There you go. Kitchen. Dining. Looks like it's in really good shape, too. They say it's one of the best locations and floor plans in the sky. So here's the um, community area, the HOA area, it looks like. <coughs> nice pool there. Go have a gander. Let's back out. See what else we got. Okay, up the coast we have one here. The skyline area. 699 Hamishaw Road. Four, three bed, two bath, 1200 square feet. Brand new permitted home never lived in. Two car attached, finished garage and tons of extra parking. Okay, so here we go. They say it's brand new construction. And there she sits. So if you're looking for a new home, V 
there you go, you got one. There's the yard. Looks like they stood on the roof to take it or lifted their, jumped on a ladder. Go check it out. Let's back it out. Let's go to the coast and work our way in. We got two over here in Point Loma. One of them, Rogers Street, 7.5 million. Three bed, four bath, 25, 27 square feet. Welcome to La Playa, fully restored mid-century modern masterpiece. Nestled. Let's take a look. Wow, look at that view, eh? Sunrise view there. How do I know? It's coming up over the mountains. I don't know where this house sits. And if you're looking over the harbor like that towards the mountains, the Coronado Bridge, it can only be a sunrise. Okay. Boy, that's pretty. Look at those city lights up there on that deck. Wow, look at that. See where they're getting the big price tag. Love all the wood. The brick. <clears throat> no one's painted the ceilings here white. You see what I mean? I mean, you just wouldn't do that. He'd ruin this. Okay, what else we got here? Just beautiful. Boy, if I could just have $7.5 million drop in my lap today, maybe I'll go buy this beautiful, beautiful home. I love these unique style homes, beautiful architecture. Could take a look at that one. Okay, we got another one here in Point Loma, 1,375,000 on Keats. Three bed, two bath, 1144 square feet in the heart of Point Loma. Original charm and modern upgrades. It's got both. There it is. I'm gonna guess on this house. This house is built in, uh, in the 40s. This, this construction is totally looks like the 40s. I mean, it could have snuck into the early 50s, but I like this construction, the raised foundation. They built a lot of this style throughout San Diego County, different areas in the 40s. And then they kind of switched it up in the 50s and went a different style. But there's your yard, garage. Let's see when this was built. 48. I like those homes built in the 40s. Okay, we have one here. It's kind of North Park. By the park, north of the park, North Park. Burlingame, south of the park, South Park. Okay, we have one here. 1.499900 Pershing. Three bed, three bath, 1,500 square feet. Rare opportunity. Everything's a rare opportunity. Is that Chat GPT? Rare opportunity to purchase a beautiful Spanish style home along with approved plans to build a modern and sleek three story ADU triplex. Oh, great, another ADU in the neighborhood. I'm sure the neighbors will love that. This is the way it works, though. This is the way things are going. These little tiny ADUs. Maybe one bedroom, one bedroom, one bedroom. Maybe they're all three studios, but it's just the way it's going. It's the future. It's a pretty home. I love these older homes, and you know what? I mean, they're just going to put up ADUs everywhere, and, uh, and that's the way it's going to go. So go have a look there, North Park. Okay, it's cut in, nothing here. We saw these below the eight. Now we have one here, Bay Park, my neck of the woods. Morency Street, 2.698, four bed, four bath, 38, 38 square feet. Modern luxury custom home located just blocks from the vibrant restaurants and shops of Bay Park. I do like those restaurants there. There's not many, but 
I mean, I love Bay Park, great little area. It's a good looking home too. Got a little pool back there, or oversized jacuzzi. Check that out. No, it's a pool, and I guess that's the jacuzzi part. Yeah, I like that a lot. There's an aerial. Sits on the alleyway too, so you get parking here. I'm out the garage and come up into your home. Let's see here. See some inside pictures. Real nice place. Nice ironwork. Kitchen. Beautiful kitchen. wine area and this workout area do your push-ups in there get your own push-up room <clears throat> all right let's see when was this built okay 2003 so it's 21 years old a newly renovated custom home he has pretty house there 2.698 see where it sits on the map there it is I didn't see a lot of views. You're down pretty low there. They didn't show a lot of views. But um, I like the location though. Still Bay Park. Real pretty. Okay, let's see. What do we have here in La Jolla? There's two. There's one for 2.545 million on Bonaire. Three bed, three bath, 1855 square feet. Tucked away in a highly sought after location. A stroll from Wind and Sea Beach. And there she is. Yeah, I mean, Wind and Sea Beach, great beach, right? So, is this a single family home or just a unit? I think it's just one of the units. Uh, sought after location, thoughtfully designed. Okay, well, I don't really know, but it looks to me like you don't get all this whole building for two. Well, maybe you do, actually. My bad. I mean, I don't know. What we got here? Yeah, I guess you get the whole building. Yeah, for a minute there, from looking at this aerial, this is it, and yeah, it's a good sized property. Four parking spots, I don't know. Can't really tell from the description either, and I'm not going to dive into it here, but go check it out and you tell me. Is that the whole building or just a, a unit in the building? Can't really tell. Okay, here we go. 6.495 million Muir lands. Five bed, four bath, 404, six square feet. Stunning residence has been fully renovated inside, showcasing an elegant Tudor style exterior. Originally built in 1933. Oh, look at that house. Look at this massive pool. A Tudor style. There you go. Built in 1933 originally and renovated. That sure looks nice. That's a pretty house. It's a La Jolla classic. Well, these guys have their little yoga studio too, like the other one did. Garage. Massive pool. big deck around the pool. I don't see them showing us any views, do you? Maybe it doesn't have any. 
<clears throat> Great location though. Got another one up here in La Jolla, La Jolla Shores. 7.8 million, Prestwick Drive. Four bed, three bath, 30, 90 square feet. The best views imaginable, panoramic, pulse racing. Ocean, whitewater, coastline, and La Jolla Cove views. From this gorgeously sited modernist home. Okay, it's a mouthful there. I do like this. Look at this pool. It's too bad the pool wasn't on the view side, but then you lose the view to the windows maybe. But Okay, so this is the garage pool kind of in the front part of the house. The back part has the views. I gotta tell you, I do like that house. There's the views out there. Showing a lot of outside shots. Show the inside. I like to see the inside. There you go. The woods left alone. I love it. Big, massive fireplace. I mean, this place is just unbelievable, right? My kind of house for sure. Look at these pictures here. That coastline down there. La Jolla Shores Beach. Looks really cool. That's it. I don't have any other pictures of the inside. A really cool place. 7.8 mil. Okay, let's go up the coast and then we'll cut in and look, look at these. 26 homes this morning up the coast. Okay, we have some here. Rancho Santa Fe, 5.395 million. Codorniz, Codorniz, four bed, five bath, 4152 square feet. Tranquil, soft, contemporary home. 60 by 12 Pebble Tech saltwater pool and spa. Well, let's let the pictures do the talking. There we go. Ooh, that's nice. I love these big windows. Look at all that greenscape, tropics, palm trees, and the like. There you go. Look at this beauty. Oh, they painted the ceilings white. You just had to paint them white. I know some people like it. I'm just not one of them. There you go. Looks nice. Nice kitchen. Beautiful property. Big garage. There you go. See the property? Looks good. Nice looking home. Nice looking piece of property too. You got two here. I guess the neighbors decided to sell at the same time. There's one here for four point four nine nine million on El Merlo. Four point four nine nine million, four bed, four bath, three thousand two hundred and fifty five square feet. Stunning three acre park like estate epitomizes the best of Rancho Santa Fe living. Nice single level. Untouched, beautiful wood ceilings. Tennis court. Big kitchen. That looks good. Big piece of land too. Go with it. Go have a gander. Got another one here for nine million. 750,000 El Merlo. Another one on El Merlo. Five bed, seven baths, 8,159 square feet. A luxury property of unrelenting equestrian splendor. Okay. Hope you have a lot of pictures. Look at this. Great house. You got your little uh, horsey stuff over here and here. Stables, stables. There's some horses out there on your property. Look at them, they're so cute. They remind me of big dogs. I love horses. Look at these two guys, just hanging out. Like big dogs you can ride around. That's what they, they remind me of. Beautiful horses. Okay, let's back out of Rancho Santa Fe. We had three there. Let's come up the coast here. Where is this exactly? 
Lauren Court, 5,200,000, four bed, four bath, 4,540 square feet. Encinitas Ranch Estate, nearly half an acre. That's a pretty home. Just a pretty home, right? Beautiful. Great curb appeal. Sitting on a, some open space behind you here. Nice looking yard. There's your kitchen. I like that lighting. They put that lighting, colored lighting. They got this piece of art here too with the lighting. <coughs> it's kind of cool. I'll check it out on Lauren Court. Very pretty. <coughs> There's one here in uh, La Costa. <coughs> Excuse me. V Via Calendo, 1.999999. Five bed, three bath, 2837 square feet. It's on a value range price. This property is indeed a dream. Let's go see it. I love the tropics and the beautiful pool. There you go. There you are. So if I have a look, if you're interested, there's another one here. This is um, kind of like South Carlsbad area. There's one here on Cabo Court, 3.73 million. Seven beds, five baths, 5,803 square feet, breathtaking panoramic ocean, lagoon, golf course, and city views from the studding custom La Costa dream home perched on a hilltop. There you go. Beautiful skies we've had lately here in San Diego. It's a nice view to sit out there after dinner, watch the sunset. There's the house, cul de sac. Cul de sac means bottom of the bag in French. Cul de sac. There we go. So if this interests you, there's the lagoon. Go have a look. Very pretty. Okay, there's three there we just saw. Let's go up the coast. We got one here, Oceanside, west of the five. And this one's listed at 3,895,000 on the Strand. Five bed, five baths, 4,318 square feet, oceanfront property under four million, endless summer. Who doesn't want to be on the sand? Under four million, they're right. I mean, that's your view out the window. Right here. Pretty cool property. Go check it out if you want to be right on the sand in San Diego. San Diego. Okay. Um, did we see these? Yeah. Carlsbad. Okay, let's up here in Fallbrook. We have one for 1525000 on North Stage Terrace. Four beds, four baths, 4,103 square feet. Nestled in the heart of Fallbrook. Four spacious bedrooms. 3.5 bathrooms. Let's check it out. Nice big estate here. Nice backyard. Pool with a big slide. Definitely out there all alone. You don't see your neighbors really. Okay, let's see a couple of kitchen shots. Didn't paint the ceilings, thank you. And there you have it. Beautiful home. 
Okay, let's back out. Let's grab this one in Borrego for 325,000. San Pablo Road, two bed, two bath, 1412 square feet. Unique home with high ceilings. Roof slanted towards the south. It includes a total of three parcels. So you get these three parcels and the house in the middle. Let's have a look. There you go. I like those desert views. A wood burning stove there. Pretty cool looking property. If you're looking out in Borrego, you get your 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 property and two other lots with it. Okay, what do we got here? <coughs> Tory Highlands, Amber Place, 1.649 million, three bed, three bath, 2156 square feet. A modern retreat in the heart of Tory Del Mar. A sought after neighborhood in Carmel Valley. There it is. There's your kitchen. It's like the master bedroom. And there she sits, end of a cul-de-sac. Not a lot of pictures. Go have a look. Okay, Poway. One million one hundred seventy-five thousand. Acton. Four bed, two bath, 2019 square feet. Stunning four bedroom home in Poway. A must see. It's a must see, they say. There's the kitchen. There's the uh, outside. Totally concreted up. <clears throat> in blue. It's kind of an uncommon color. Sitting area here. You can see it there. They say it's a must-see, so I guess you got to go see it. <clears throat> Tell me what you think. Okay, let's go see this one in Mira Mesa. 925 on Flanders. Four bed, two bath, 1624 square feet. Let's take a look. Okay, so if you're interested, take a look at this one here. Let's go see this one here. Legacy Terrace, 1.795, five beds, four baths, 3,011 square feet. Scripps Legacy in the wonderful Scripps Ranch community. There you go. Three car garage, lots of parking in the front. High ceilings, nice piano for the piano lovers. There's the kitchen. What do we got for a yard? A nice little yard with a covered area. There's an aerial on a cul-de-sac, open space. Real nice. Okay, this one here is listed at 2.795 on Terrabon. Four bed, four bath, 3,656 square feet. Grand entrance leads to your private low maintenance vineyard. Wow, a vineyard. Look at that. Well, that's really nice. It's like a bar. And dice for tables there. Kitchen. Got backyard, you got a little pool. Fireplace. I like the hardscape work. Looks really nice. I guess this is your little little vineyard back there. Little little taste of Tuscany. Go check it out. Okay, let's back out. We got all these. That's all of them. We saw the one out there in Borrego. Nothing out here. So that's all of them this morning for homes 26. Now let's take a look at those 18 condos. Okay, 18 condos, south to north. 
Nothing down here in IB, Otay Mesa, San Ysidro. Looks like there's one, two in Chula Vista. We have one out here. It's East Lake Shores, one of the original areas of East Lake. Satellite view. This is the lake that made East Lake East Lake, the man made lake. Let's take a look. We have one for 564. Lake Ridge Circle, three bed, two bath, 1166 square feet. Ultimate blend of comfort and style. Nestled on the first floor in Camelot. There she is. There you have it. Go take a look. There's another one for 500. Come on. And 29.9 Brookstone, two bed, two bath, 956 square feet. Live out the dream of lakeside living. There it is. Live out the dream of lakeside living. Go have a look. Two of them there are really close. It's a cool little area too. Okay, let's go. Uh, nothing else down here. Let's go up north. Nothing downtown. That's another rarity. Okay, let's stay south of the 8. There's one here in Point Loma, OB area, Voltaire Street, 1.3. 59900, three bed, three bath, 1656 square feet, 2024 built new construction townhome in Point Loma with amazing finishes. Let's see it. Who doesn't like new? Especially in this area. I mean, there's nothing new in this area. <clears throat> Infill projects. And uh, you're not going to see a lot of these. So it's pretty unique to have a new construction in this area for sure. It's right here. Go take a look. Okay, there's one here. <coughs> in Bankers Hill. Three million four hundred ninety five thousand sixth Avenue. Three bed, three bath, forty two seventy square feet. Welcome to contemporary urban living at its finest. This stunning park laurel condo. Boy, I love these big windows. Nice views. Looks like it's overlooking the park. There you go. You're that close to Balboa Park. Balboa Park across the street. The airport. So I'm going to take a look. Real nice property. <clears throat> Very unique. There's how it looks at night from the park looking at it. Looks really cool. Okay, let's back out. We got one up here. University Heights. Let's see. Hamilton, 589, two bed, one bath, 728 square feet. Charming. University Heights. Very walkable, they say. There it is. community pool. It's back out. Got one over here. 389,000. 48th Street, two bed, two bath, 852 square feet. Move in ready first floor condo. There you go, Spanish tile. I love Spanish tile. So if you're interested, you take a look at that one there. Let's back out of here and let's go up here. Stay below the 8, there's nothing. So let's bring it in. La Mesa, just above the 8, there's one for 399000 on Parkway Drive. One bed, one bath. 646 square feet. Charming one bedroom, one bath condo in La Mesa. Nice looking property. Great condition. Go have a look. Got a little balcony there. Okay, let's cut in. Nothing in Mission Valley this morning. 
Okay, we have one here. Oh yeah, oceanfront walk down in Mission Beach, 3.42 million. Three bed, three bath, 1799 square feet, the pinnacle of coastal living. Yeah, I do love it down there for sure. Got a little side view here. Got a corner view here. Is this right looking at the water? Oh yeah, look at that. That's pretty special. Great location. You want to be right on the beach down there. You want to go look at this. There you go. It's your deck up there. You're on the second story. Get a little bit away from the boardwalk noise and hustle and bustle and come out there and sit high above it. Yeah, look at that. There you go. 3.42 mil. Okay, now let's go up the coast here. University City has one for 929. Playmore Terrace, three bed, three bath, 1342 square feet. Move in ready gym. Walking distance to the UTC Mall. Okay, there it is. Okay, there it is. Kind of showing you where it sits. Back out. Okay, we got a couple here. Let's take a look at these. It's kind of Sorrento Valley. Uh, they're so close I can't show them. It won't divide them when they see two listings, unfortunately, but this is a great area because it's a it's kind of like the heart of Sorrento Valley. Most of the homes are up here. And, um, you know, if you worked at one of the Qualcomm buildings here or one of the other buildings, other companies, Qualcomm has a lot going on here. You'd be really easy commute to work, go home for lunch. I mean, you'd be totally dialed in. Okay, let's grab all three of these. We have one here for 824 on Voyager Circle, two bed, two bath, 1097 square feet. Best of everything Carmel Valley has to offer. Okay. Looks like a nice property. Voyager Circle. It's a community pool area. Got another one here for 949000 on Carmel Country Road. Two bed, three bath, 1178 square feet. Welcome home to this tri-level townhome in Elysian Complex of Carmel Valley. There it is. Nice looking home, condo, it's the community pools. Looks really nice. And we got another one here, Pacific Highlands Ranch area for 1,625,000 on Lumen. Four bed, four bath, 2117 square feet. Brand new end unit home just completed by Shea. That's cool. They still got some projects there where they're building new. There's not much of those up there anymore. Looks really nice there, Shea. Shea Homes. It's good to see Shea Homes building. Looks really nice too. Right by the shopping. Okay, let's back out. Let's go up the coast. Nothing up here in Encinitas, Cardiff, Carlsbad, nothing by the coast in Oceanside. There is one inland in Oceanside. And this one's listed at 574 900 on Plover. Two bed, two bath, 1064 square feet. Welcome to this delightful two bedroom, two bathroom, single story gem. Oceana Missions 3 community. 55 plus. You gotta be 55 or older to buy here. But it looks good. A nice looking property. 
Got some great amenities too. You'll have a look if you're 55 plus. Okay, let's go up the coast here. Nothing up in Fallbrook, Escondido. We have one right in the heart of Escondido. 520. 519.9 North Beach, three bed, two bath, 1074 square feet. Welcome to your dream home. Okay, here we go. All right, Escondido. <clears throat> What do we got here? Rancho Bernardo. Caminito Cantalina. 575. Two bed, two bath, 1056 square feet. Enjoy a light, fresh ambiance in the Murata neighborhood of the gated Bernardo, Bernardo Vista Lago community. There you go. Some of the community stuff that's going on there. The HOA. Got a little pool room there. Shoot a little pool. Take a little dip in the pool. Okay, let's back out. Got one here. Poway. Sabre Springs. Creekview Drive. 750. Two bed. Three bath. 1049 square feet. In the heart of San Diego Sabre Springs community. Let's go take a look. There it is. High ceilings. These feel more like a home than a condo for sure. A little dated, but looks good. And you can update it over time if you want to. Let's see what we got. Here's the community pool. Okay, let's back out. We saw well, we couldn't see these two in Sorrento, unfortunately. Well, that's it for this morning. That was 18 condos. We saw 26 homes, 44 properties total this morning on this Tuesday morning. So anything out there interests you, go have a look. Anything real estate related in San Diego County, give the Lewis team a call. We'd love to help you out. And until tomorrow, make it a great day. Cheers.